Older adult veterans and veterans with disabilities are finding a new place to call home with the implementation of the Cincinnati VA Medical Center Medical Foster Home Program in the greater Cincinnati area. Here to tell us more is Leslie Cooper. She's the Medical Foster Home Program Coordinator at the Cincinnati VA Medical Center. And thanks for talking with us today, Leslie. Hi, thanks for having me. So tell us more about the Medical Foster Home Program. What is it? So the Medical Foster Home Program is a national incentive um, new to Cincinnati, but we will be placing veterans that are medically fragile or veterans that are uh, technically eligible for a nursing home setting. It's an alternative to a nursing home. We will place veterans in a home with a family or a caregiver, kind of like a traditional foster home program for children. How can our veterans determine if a medical foster home is right for them? Well, if a veteran is unsafe to live at home by himself or herself, they may feel they need assistance with daily living activities like dressing or even feeding themselves, or even if they need traditional um, support with getting groceries or um, transportation to appointments, but need just a little bit more support than they're able to give themselves while living independently. Well, Leslie, if someone watching this is interested in housing a veteran, what do they need to consider before they make that decision? So first they would need to schedule a meeting with myself and I would come out to physically um, get a general idea of the living environment. From there they would have to go through um, a background check, a fire and safety check, and a nutritional um, inspection just to make sure they would be able to provide uh, well-balanced meals in their home. And then from there uh, it would be discussed by uh, the National Board for approval of the, the medical foster home caregiver. Well, Leslie, we certainly want to make sure our veterans get the very best care possible. If a veteran's interested in residing at a VA medical foster home, or if someone's interested in pre-qualifying their home as a VA medical foster home, what should they do? They should call me, Leslie Cooper. And my number is 513-693-0584. They decide they want to be a caregiver. Number one, they need to really think seriously about the time and effort giving to a veteran. They would need to be able to house the veteran in their home. This is not a group home type setting. The veteran would actually live with the person or the caregiver. And if they have the patience and the willingness to be a caregiver. Well, a lot of great information, Leslie. Thanks so much. Thank you. I appreciate you all having me today.